First alerted you to about two weeks ago, predators using artificial intelligence to manipulate and turn people's Facebook photos, including of their children, into pornographic ones. That is currently legal under state law. State Senator Azra Jacques is circulating a new bill now that would make deep fakes, such as photoshopping the face of a real person onto an AI-generated body, illegal. Brittany Schmidt covering this story again for us joins us now. We talked about this a couple of weeks ago, you and I. So let's refresh so people know what is legal in the state right now when it comes to this. Right. So when I talked to Brown County's ICAC team and it's the Internet Crimes Against Children, we're specifically we're talking about child sex crimes against children. Um, and basically what is legal to possess in the in Wisconsin right now is we originally talked about child pornography that was anime. So like mm -hmm. cartoon likes that's legal to possess in in Wisconsin. And also, as you mentioned, any photos that say someone takes a photo off of Facebook and they Photoshop the face out and they put it on an AI generated sexually explicit photo and you put the face on it, that is legal to possess as well because that's technically what they deem a victimless crime okay. because it's not that entire person, it's just the face. Okay. So what does the bill target? In, as it pertains to those those instances that you just talked about, those right. examples. So the bill specifically. So right now, under current state law, if you um, if you create or pass along or sell a nude photo of someone, it, you're punishable up to a, fel uh, a felony in Wisconsin, three and a half years in prison, or a ten thousand dollar fine. So what this bill does from Andre Jacques is it expands the bill to include those deep fake photos. So the ones that are photoshopped from Facebook sure. where they legally obtain it off of somebody's Facebook and they make it into an AI generated photo, usually pornographic in nature. So that would the bill that's currently on it would expand to include all those deep fakes as well. All right. So you mentioned in our conversation a couple of weeks ago with that ICAC investigator that mm -hmm. Wisconsin's kind of behind the curve here yes. on this. We talked about it in the open of the show. Senator Jacques has tried to introduce legislation like this in the past. He hasn't had much luck with it. So why is he confident that he can get this one through? So he said last year when he had it, he had bipartisan support. He got it on the table, but they dropped in the 11th hour. And he said he was frustrated because this is something that is continuously changing and we are behind the eight ball and legislators know it. Even investigators know it. It's hard to prosecute victimless crimes, especially hold people accountable for something that's legal to possess in Wisconsin. So he says now with um, the AGs, all 50 mm -hmm. of them have written a letter to Congress that we talked about, Correct. basically encouraging Congress to study AI and how it can be used to exploit children. He's like, this is the momentum that's needed to get more support. He's co He's got that bill going around. He's trying to get co-sponsors for it, but he's confident that it'll be on the floor this year. Okay. Technology moves fast. He'd like to see the legislature move fast on this as right. well. Brittany, thanks so much for that.